let this be a normal field trip? With a friend? No way! Oh. Cruising on down Main Street, you're relaxed and feeling good. Yeah. Next thing that you know, you're seeing. <laughs> Octopus in the neighborhood, surfing on a sine wave, swinging through the stars. Yeah. Take a left at your intestine, take your second right past Mars. I'm a magic school bus. Alligator nostril. I'm on the magic school bus. Right to the sea. Come on in and don't be shy. Come on. Just to make your day complete, you might get baked into a pie on a magic school bus. Step inside, it's a wild ride. Come on, right on the magic school bus. Okay, this is it. Tie game, bottom of the ninth, base is loaded. All you gotta do is slam the ball over the left field fence and win the seventh game of the World Series! Ralphie! 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 Wake up! Ralphie, you're up! <laughs> oh, right, Keisha. I knew that. Hey, Wanda, where's home plate? There isn't one, Ralphie. Just pretend. Pretend? Me? But I'll have nothing to slide into when I hit a home run. You'll have nothing to hit if you don't let me pitch. Oh, all right, I'll pretend. <laughs> hey, you guys, check this out. <laughs> oh. I just found out the coolest thing. Yoo-hoo, yoo-hoo, Liz, Liz, come here. Dorothy and not now. I'm one swing away from hitting my way into the record books. But you've got to see this. It'll change your lives. Whatever it is, it can't be more important than our baseball game. I just finished this book. A Child's Garden of Physics. Huh? <laughs> I'm really happy for you, DA. We can't wait to hear the book report. But right now, I've got a game-winning home run against. So if you could just get off the field... But, Ralphie, you don't understand. This book's all about what gets things moving and what makes them stop. Forces, friction, pushes, pulls. Forces? Friction? Pushes? Pulls? And as I always say, where there's physics, there's a field trip. Woohoo! Listen, a force is just a push or a pull. If you're gonna force us to listen to this... You're being kind of pushy, don't you think? No, no. I'm talking about real forces. Picture this. There's this big red sled sitting in the snow, not going anywhere. But if somebody comes along and gives it a push... Who? It doesn't matter, Arnold. If somebody comes and... I need to know so I can complete my mental picture. Yeah, me too. Okay, okay. How about Napoleon? Fine. If Napoleon comes along and gives the sled a push, it'll move. That's a force. And it'll keep moving on the slippery snow until something stops it. Like the entire British Army? No, like some dirt. Things rubbing together cause a force called friction. The sled stops because of the friction of the dirt against the runners. Friction slows down and stops nearly every motion on Earth. You stopped our game to tell us that? Isn't that cool? Let us know when they make the movie, okay, DA? <laughs> <laughs> Very funny, you guys. Well, I think friction is fascinating. Well, I think it's... Hey. Dorothy Ann, no, wait! You know, that book does sound sort of cool. It is! And look at this, Ralphie. Page 97. Hey. It's a baseball field. But it would be impossible to play normal baseball there. There's no friction. You know, Dorothy Ann, this is one amazing book. Flat, sturdy, white, and the right size. Hmm. GDA, do you think maybe I could borrow it? 
Sure, but you have to promise to take care of it. Miss Scout's honor. You're up, Ralphie. Thanks, DA. All aboard! Now? But, but, Miss Frizzle, we're in the middle of the most important competition in the history of sports. Just a delay of game, Ralphie. Delay of game? What for? Field trip delay. It's time to explore the unknown. Be adventurous, brave, and bold. Let's go. Field trip. Just as long as we don't get blasted, roasted, toasted, or eaten, I'm happy. Oh, don't worry, Arnold. That's not until next week. Today, we're going to a baseball game. All right! This is so cool. A baseball game? That's not new or different or exciting. What? Let's go someplace really unusual. Like that place I showed you, Ralphie. You know, page 97. Show them. Um, yeah. Well, uh... <laughs> Ralphie, how could you? Well, you know, it was the right size and with the white cover and all, it made a great home plate. Hey, it's not like I ruined it. Please, Miss Frizzle, can we get my book before we go? No occasion for agitation, Dorothy Ann. We'll not only get your book, we'll keep Ralphie happy, too. We will? Mm -hmm. Bus, do your stuff! <laughs> ah, time to hit the books! <laughs> Think we are? Yes, yes, we are. At my old school, the librarian never let us drive in our books. Miss Frizzle, stop here, please. Page ninety-seven. It's the page I was talking about. It's all about a world without friction. It looks like the world of baseball to me. Come on. Ralphie, watch out! The ground on that field has no... Whoa! Whoa! Friction! Whoa! Whoa! I can't stop! Wow! It's Ralphie the runaway pinball! Yeah, there's no stopping him now. Without friction, how are to stop him. What would happen if something smashed into him? Right. A force pushing the other way. But, but what can we use? The only forces we can control in there are... Us! Take me out of the friction where things just slow to a stop. La 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 This way, class. Something tells me I should have stayed home today. Who knew he'd wind up inside a drawing? I wonder what would happen if I tried to run. Whoa! Ooh, not a good idea! Oh boy, is this ever weird. Hi! For friction. Whoa! Whoa! <laughs> Forget walking. I just want to stand up. How about a forest to get you going, Dorothy Ann? Like a whoosh? <laughs> Whee! Never fear, Ralphie! A push to the rescue! <laughs> there! I saved you! Saved me? I was having a blast! Hey, D.A., looks like Ralphie gave you the push-off. <laughs> That's the last time I saved him. Whoa! Whoa. Phew, that was close. Whoa. Look how 
on the bright side, Arnold. No friction, no grass stains. Okay, hit it, Liz! And what a beautifully frictionless day it is. Miss Frizzle, where did you learn to announce like that? You'd be surprised what teachers do during the summer break. But let's talk about the game, D.A. Oh, yes. Well, folks, believe it or not, we're coming to you live from inside my textbook. Our playing field today is slipperier than ice and slicker than spit. The ground out there has no, we repeat, no friction, folks. On the mound is Wanda, one of the most outstanding pitchers in the class. And master of the famed bubblegum ball. You ready for this, Ralphie? Try me. First up is Ralphie, the most fearsome four-foot hitter in the league. And there's the pitch! Whoa! And look at that, folks. The force Wanda used really got that ball going and pushed her way back towards second. It's a swing! I got it! And a miss. No. Oh. Oops. Sorry, Miss Frizzle. Ooh. And a serious catcher-teacher hip check. Ugh. What's going on here? Another pitch. This one looks good! A hot grounder down the third baseline. But Dorothy Ann, what do you think has happened to our batter? Hey, this isn't fun! Honey! Oh, Yes, yes, Ralphie is going for a double with a spin on it. Oh, dear. Just look at that ball go, folks. <laughs> That's what happens when there's no friction from the ground to slow it down. Oops. Oh, look at Ralphie go. Oh, no. Double play. <laughs> oh. Okay, I'll play second. It's all yours. Ralphie! Then again, me! 
maybe not. Very good, Wanda. A push is one force that can get us moving. What's the opposite? A pull? A pull! A pull. Excellent. This is more like it. Thanks, boss. Huh? Hey! Wait a sec. Where is everybody? <laughs> Grab on, you guys! <laughs> pull! 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 Wow, you're right, DA. We had no idea friction did so much. Dorothy Ann, could I borrow that book when Ralphie's done with it? Uh, can I too? Then me! Wait a sec. No one gets the book until we get out of it. He's got a point. I guess so. To the bus! Is everyone seated? Yes, Miss Frizzle. Then let's book it! <laughs> What's that noise? <gasps> At my old school, we only pressed flowers in our books. Any suggestions, class? Better gut him, Miss Frizzle. Excellent idea, Wanda. Same page, please. Step on it, Liz! There's not enough friction down here to push the bus out! There's too much friction up here! Okay, okay, where do we stand? Uh, somewhere between page 96 and 97. Carlos! Hey, just trying to lighten things up. Lighten things up, that's it. Climb up on the roof and push up on the book. Let me get the facts. You're saying we should hold up the book, get in the bus, and drive away? Yes. How? Good question, Arnold. Anyone have an answer? DA, this is all your fault! Ralphie, you're a genius. Look, the letters peel off the page. I have a plan. We split into two teams, right? Right. Ralphie's team goes on the roof and pushes up on the book, while my team piles letters up under here to hold the book up long enough for us to get out. Like this. Exactly. Let's do it! Let her rip! Carlos, take a letter. <laughs> <laughs> Excellent plan. But why doesn't your team push up on the book while my team piles the letters, okay? Okay. Not okay! Yes, okay! Not! Yes, okay! Not! Um, DA, what is it again that makes everything stop? Friction! And if there's a lot of it, you can't get anywhere. Right, Ralphie? Yes? Well, I think there's a little too much friction between you two. So if we're ever going to get out of this book, we'd, we'd better get, get rid of the friction between us! Sorry. No, I'm sorry. Well, I'm even sorrier. No, I'm sorrier. No, I'm sorrier. And I'm sorrier than both of you. Okay, let's try it. Push! Come on, you bunch of Weasley wimps, push! It's working! Oh. More ladders! Oh. the book 
talking through the words, back to the class we go. and shut case. Carlos! <laughs> Hang on, Ralphie. Remember what happened last time you jumped out of the bus like that? Never fear. There's friction here. Good old friction. Friction fans, welcome to the All Frizzle Complete with Friction Baseball Classic. Yes, sir, it's a beautiful day here at Frizzle Field, and have we got a game for you. The first up is our very own Dorothy Ann. I tell you, Keisha, if she hits the ball as hard as she hits the books, watch out! Oh, a tremendous hit deep into center. Holy cow, she exerted some kind of force on that ball. But can the left fielder Carlos get to the ball and apply his force to stop it? No, he can't! What a shot, folks! But lucky for Carlos, the friction of the ball against the grass has slowed it to a stop. What would we do without friction, folks? Yahoo! Come on, children! And DA finds a friend in friction as she slides home. The big question, is she safe or out? I don't know, Keisha. I can't make out the plate. That's funny. N neither can I. Where is it? I think it's over there. D.A. was right. This book is great! As I always say, Ralphie, never judge a book by its cover. <laughs> School bus? Is this the magic school bus? 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 I wonder what the magic school bus is. I want the magic school bus! Another day, another... Ooh, caller? Now, who could that be? Hello, Magic School Bus producer speaking. Hi, you know that textbook, The Bus and the Kids Went Inside? Oh, wonderful book, isn't it? Yeah, I'd like to know where I can get a copy. So you can visit a world without friction? Right, I already checked the library. Where'd you look? In the non-friction section, of course. Well, actually, you can find non-friction anywhere. But here on Earth, I thought friction was the only game in town. It is, but you'd be surprised how many ways we can give friction the slip. You mean like sliding down a slide? Exactly. Very little friction, but lots of fun. Or playing shuffleboard? Oh, and of course. Ice skating! She shoots! She scores! Uh, uh, yes. Uh, snow skiing. And water skiing. Snow sledding. Skateboarding. Oh, and don't forget, log rolling. Very non-frictional. So friction is all around us, but sometimes there's just less of it. Exactly. And sometimes, a lack of friction can surprise you. Yes, I suppose it could surprise you. <laughs> Thanks. Non-friction is my favorite. Oh. Sometimes working on this show is stranger than friction. Your 
goes right to the sea. Come on in and don't be shy. Come on. Just to make your day. 